But this R&D program uh, is now at the stage of becoming an industrial productor. We produce at industrial scale in Brazil this farnesine. This has been mixed in a flight, in the, in the, in the kerosene, used for flight between Toulouse and Le Bourget. First time a real flight, uh, and it was uh, just the uh, opportunity to prove two things. First, that we are ready uh, to really start speaking in uh, industrial terms. And second, that uh, this illustrates the potential partnerships that can be uh, put together between the major actors of the uh, aeronautic industry and Total. This initiative gathered Airbus, of course, Air France, Safran and Total, just to show that uh, we work together and we're all aligned towards the same objective, which is be more efficient and prepare uh, the transportation of the future. Very important for us to work together as a whole in the industry to reduce our environmental impact. We're absolutely committed to it, obviously uh, through um, developing more fuel-efficient aircraft, but we also support research and development in other areas, and alternative fuels and biofuels is a really important area where Airbus can play um, a catalytic role and bring together the players to do that. And today is an example of just that with our partnership uh, with uh, Total and uh, with the GFAST, and it was really um, an initiative that uh, puts forward the French partners uh, in particular in uh, today's uh, biofuel flight. When we can be more fuel efficient, uh, we're also reducing CO2 and that's what uh, sustainable aviation is all about. Delivering more for our customers and less for the environment. Today's uh, in event was um, of uh, a particular first because we flew not just with biofuels but on the A321 Sharklet. So that's uh, two aspects that will help uh, to reduce uh, CO2 and uh, the Sharklets um, are reducing uh, fuel consumption by 4%. So that plus the biofuel is really a great example of innovation and uh, sustainable aviation.